So how can you fix apps which are automatically closing on your iPad? Let's get into it. So there are more ways or reasons why it might be happening. For example, the actual app may not be up to date anymore. So for example, if you open up the App Store and check out your particular apps, like I don't know what I have on this iPad, like for example, as you can see, it is the uh, Instagram which I have installed and I can check it out and see if there isn't any update available. So for me, it says open right here, meaning that I'm running the latest version and it applies to most other apps. But for example, as you can see right here, we have Snapchat and this one has an update available, which I can click on and it is being downloaded and installed. So most likely this is going to be the case. Just make sure you get the latest version of any app and you're going to be good to go. You can see, in fact, that, that some apps are being updated automatically on my iPad. You can see that there is Discord installing like Google Maps and like Adobe Acrobat. So all of these apps are actually uh, being like updated on their own. And in order to make sure that this happens automatically, you can open up the settings app of your iPad, tap on apps at the bottom and locate the app store where as you can see the automatic downloads for app updates is turned on for me. So if you don't like it, you can turn it off, but if you never want to even care about it, then make sure you have it automatically updated and your apps should be good to go. Outside of that, obviously don't forget about the software update for your entire iPad. As you can see, there is iPad OS 18.6 currently being available for my iPad and I haven't updated just yet. So it would be a great idea. It would make sense to update right now or even just click it for tonight and make sure I run all of the later uh, versions. So yeah, that's it. This is most likely what's causing it. Outside of that, like simple restarts and all of that kind of stuff might help, but usually the apps should work as long as the developers made them properly functional. So that's going to be about it. Let me know below in the comments if there are more thoughts or questions you might have. I'm going to wrap up the video and hopefully I'll see you later.